Oh, you know, kind of meme around with Gordo or so yeah, stick with Hyde. Looks like he's going straight to Hyde, so. But yeah, and Doc Dr. Dang is uh, sticking with Hyde too. Uh, yeah, not too familiar uh, with his play. But um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. And it looks like Vidyar gets first hit. Taking him to the corner. Okay, ooh, dangerous, you know, got a stand shield right there, but uh, managed to not get hit too bad off of it. Alright, and then, oh, okay, wake up buttons. Um, okay, here we go. Corner's JDR. Oh, but yeah, gets hit out of it. Alright, yeah, JDR's taking that shield. Oh, okay, random pogo. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what that was, maybe a missing play. Yeah, here we go. Oh, okay, he got hit. Alright, uh, but doesn't convert into full combo right there, so... Oh, yeah. JDR sends a meter, makes it his turn. Um, Warper... Oh, gets a hit, so I think he's gonna win this Warper cycle, yup. Yeah. Alright. Good, decent damage. Oh, no! Caught massing! But, oh, doesn't finish the combo, though. So, oh, this is Dr. Ding's chance to come back. Oh, okay. Sends a meter for the orbital. And, um, yeah, probably not gonna kill off of this. Ooh, that's a- Oh, okay, Veil off, but, um, yeah, JDR is patient enough to wait it out. So, yeah, JDR will go up one. And, um, yeah, let's see, uh, if Dr. Dang sticks with, uh, Hai. So, yeah, it looks like, uh, he had a few opportunities there, but wasn't able to capitalize the full combos. And, um, yeah. Oh, a nice little dodge there with the orbiter. Um, so yeah, it, do, it does look like, uh, he is familiar, uh, at least somewhat, with the mechanics of UD. Um, especially with that veil off there at the end, but, um, yeah, he's just not able to get his combos in. And then, you know, against JDR, you know, he's one of the better hides NA, so definitely, uh, not, you know, gotta take all your chances and make the most out of them. But yeah, so with that said, um, yeah, JD is gonna take this more full map. Oh, again, yeah, and it seems like he's uh, waking up buttons a lot over here. Um, yeah, and that's really unfortunate because, I mean, yeah, you don't want to block too much of high um, due to the whole chip damage thing, but, you know, it's pretty negligent, you know. Oh, no, gets stuffed out of that super. Um, good to know, no invul there. Yeah, 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 this is looking uh, pretty good for JDR right now. He's on match point. Oh, a little skip right there. Alright, so yeah, uses the ES orb will go in. Oh no, that's gonna be a punish right there. Oh! But uh doesn't get the full combos, like, yeah, just right over his head, so he got a side switch. Um, but here we go. Dr. Dang, oh, and this should do it? Yeah, alright. So yeah, JDR goes ahead and takes it 2-0. Oh. And then uh, we'll go ahead and get a next match set up. But yeah, GG's. Uh, good stuff to Dr. Dang. Um, looks like uh, JDR is giving him some tips right now. But um, yeah, it's, you know, it's, it's, it looks like he's still learning. Still learning. But um, you know, definitely does have some of the mechanics down. So yeah, good stuff to him. And then we'll see what's up for our next match. Uh, let's see if we can find Axel and Inept Square. I'll go ahead and try to find them. Uh, but yeah, I'll be right back. Our TO is currently playing his match. Oh, it looks like it just finished, so... Um, yeah, I believe... Yeah, we'll try, probably try to get uh, Axel and Inept Square up next. Or, I don't know, I uh, can also play my match, I believe. I think my opponent uh, is free right now. But, um. Are you looking for an F square? Profit? Oh, uh, okay. Um. Yeah, so it looks like um, an F square will be is playing Dragon Ball right now. 
Um, so yeah, we won't be able to get him on, but we're looking for uh, Prophet, my opponent right now. Um, so yeah, if we find him, then I'll go ahead and go on next. Uh, want me to do a yell? Alright, so yeah, it looks like uh, I'll be playing Prophet on on stream right now, so yeah, I'll go ahead and get on up there. See y'all on the other side. Alright, so uh, looks like we'll be getting uh, Axel versus Annette Square. So uh, Axel is a up and coming Seth player over here. Um, yeah, he's been really grinding hard. Um, earlier you saw him on training mode, you know, practicing his stuff. So yeah, we'll see where he's coming to. And um, Annette Square, I believe, is a newer player to the game. Um, let's see, I'm not sure who his character is, but let me set up the names real quick. All right. So yeah, we going in real soon. So oh, we got chaos. Yo, okay, cool. All right, haven't seen a chaos player in uh, North Cal in a while. Uh, I'm trying to remember who was playing um uh, back in L. Uh, yeah, I can't recall. I believe it might have been Gravity Penguin before he switched to Merkava. I don't know if I'm making 18! Yo, Ray! Oh. Alright, so yeah, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, so yeah, we're right in there. Uh, oh, looks. Oh, never mind. <laughs> looks like we got. Yeah, I just got a button check over here. Uh, so yeah, we'll see. Is it gonna be chaos? Yep, yeah, it is chaos. Cool, good stuff. All right, so, oh, excuse me, got the names backwards. Um, yeah, again, uh, Axel is the Seth player, so, yeah. Uh, last time I had, a, you know, I had the reads, it's, had the reads and everything, but, um, yeah, you just see combo drops there that, um, you know, cost them, uh, some of the matches. I know uh, against me especially. Um, but yeah, see, I mean, he was grinding his combos earlier, so hopefully, yeah, we'll see him, uh, get the- Ooh, okay, gets one to 60. Oh, but nothing after it. And, um, yeah, we're not seeing any Azzy yet. Um, so- Oh, there he is, okay. Oh, but yeah. That was not the one, and his step is in there. Oh, just misses with the orb. Here we go. Okay, so yeah, we got we got combos. Yeah, we okay. So we know how to play. Good stuff. Good stuff. Alright. Oh. oh, okay. No, no combo though. Oh, and again, uh, another drop, but. Yeah, both players still pretty even. Um, Axel does have some Warple Cycle, but... Oh, gets him right there. Here we go. Okay. Oh, Assault. And yeah, he should be able to take it with this. Oh, no, with the drop. So, and that square is alive. He's still in there. Oh, okay. That'll do it for sure, though. All right, let's see if Nesker can come back. Oh, yeah, the classic, right? Round star 6C, man. Yeah. Definitely, yeah. Can't catch you slipping, hitting buttons and stuff on that one. Oh, okay. He uses the lizard to get rid of the orb. Yo, okay. That, you don't really see, like, opposite style where you're using normals to get rid of the lizard. But, yeah. Oh, no. But there it goes. Yeah, as he's dipping out. All right. Here we go. Yeah, gets the full combo this time. Okay, spins the bar. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. Keeps it like that. Oh, no, gets hit by the orb. And this could be it. He does have the meter and CS. Oh, okay, but uh, yeah, but next hit will do it. 
<laughs> yeah, so yeah, definitely an uphill battle for Annette Square right now. Uh, but yeah, Chaos has definitely improved uh, in ST compared to AL. Um, I'm afraid I can't exactly list what those changes are for y'all. Um, but yeah, he's definitely a lot scarier in this version. And um, shout outs to, let's see, oh, Rakir, Trill. Or some real good. Um, I know Rick here. He's been playing Enkidu recently more, um, but he does fall. He does fall out his chaos here and there for you know when he, he's feeling down on a matchup or something. It feels like it's a little bit too impossible for Enkidu. But here we go. Oh, goes for the command grab, but yeah, real low to the ground. I, I don't know. That might have been a miss but but all good. Okay, here we go. Chaos is in there. Oh, but yeah. All right. Oh no, gets opened up right there. So yeah, that. Yeah. Okay. Good stuff. Yeah, ending with the wrong fireball there. Um, not able to set up the Oki situation. Right, here we go. All right. Okay, that, that was interesting. Um, like a kind of a setup right there. But yeah, just like he didn't commit to it, so it kind of uh, lost it. But with that said, he still takes a round though. So and that square is uh, looking a lot better this time around. Oh, got him. Yeah, uh, <laughs> he made him disappear right in front of his face. Yeah, here we go. Oh, no. Con oh, assault. Oh, but again, um, not confirming off of these hits. And, you know, they are counter hits, so that's not. Yeah, definitely it seems like there's a little bit of unfamiliarity there with um, all the confirms, you know. He does have his, um, you know, A, A, B, and Bs right there. But, um, yeah, here we go. Oh, okay. Oh no! Yeah, so that's the thing. There is a dead zone with that 6C right in front of Chaos. Um, but yeah, that's all good. And that square is gonna take that and tie it up 1-1. So yeah, good stuff. Yeah, let's see what kind of adjustments Axe is gonna come. Um, again, I think it's just a lot of um, not getting those rent stray hits and turning them into full combos and knockdowns. Uh, that's uh, really getting Axe to suffer here. Yo, I like that, bro. <laughs> Ooh, counter hit. Let's go. Oh, um, Meaty's a little bit too early, but luckily doesn't get punished for it. Oh, no. Oh, yo, we flipping. Yo, we flipping. We rolling. We everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, okay, spending the bar. Oh, third fireball misses, though. Yeah, definitely um, unlike Merkaba's, where the third fireball almost always seems to hit. Oh, but here we go. Axel's turn. And yeah, he keeps this up and uh, steals the next cycle. Oh, no, but wake up buttons. And this is going to put a net square at match point. Again with the st oh yeah see had to punish this time yeah yeah that's one thing yeah if you if you smell the 6C coming like you can if you block and you're close up definitely go ahead punish that boy oh okay nice yeah gonna get the anti air off of that assault so yeah Axel yeah showing some signs of like oh no and then, Oh, but still, yeah, hits the assault, so Axel coming back in there, saying that he ain't out, he's still in this, you know. Like, this dude don't even like to read. Oh, again, yeah, these gotta be some drop inputs over there, because full screen command grab is definitely not the one. Or, sorry, you know, he, Seth does actually have a command grab, so I guess an uh, error block of Oh, here it goes. Sets up the orb. Ooh, a little scary there. Oh, but oh no. Um, yeah, he uses A instead of B right there for the confirm, and yeah, drops it. Okay. Uh, six six C's and goes in there. Oh wow. Doesn't get hit by the orb. Good stuff. Ooh. Oh no. Oh wow, an Axel goes in. Uh, this can do it. Yeah. There we go. Axel goes ahead and yeah, rec nice recovery there and takes it over an F square. Yeah, so it's looking real close there at the end, but Axel definitely had a rally. 
Um, yeah, and was just like rushing him down a lot more, uh, getting in there and definitely sniffing out that six C, not letting that. Um, yeah, although uh, Nip Square wasn't, you know, getting the full six C combos, he was using that as a chance, you know, get Asley set, set up, you know, get his spacing, um, you know, where he wanted to be. But yeah, good stuff. Uh, so I, I will be the next match. Uh, I'll be fighting against Profit. I uh, can't remember uh, who his character choice is, but you know, you know me, man. I love my Brock, so we will definitely be having Merkava coming up real soon. So Hagure on the, I believe Hagure is on the right. Yeah, so let me swap that real quick. All right, so Axel on the left, Rock and Seth, he's, and he's getting mauled right now. Shield. All right, DP right there. Nope, can't get. Yeah. So punishes the uh, concentration right in front of his face, which is good. Gets him back into the corner too. So. Oh, nice. No, drops his combo, but American resets. Let's go. Sets the orb. No, drops it again. Oh, but Haguri pressing buttons. Yep, EXDP. That's. Okay, yeah, so he's not quite safe there. And no! Oh! Yeah, that would have been it if he got us hit there. Now Higuri's alive and he's gonna summon the homies? Does not summon the homies. Yep, CS, wake up buttons. The classic. Okay, so. Just. Wow, both of them. Neither! player respecting each other right now. Just start off buttons. But Seth uh, in control now. Yep, EXDP again, yeah. So Haguri really likes that EXDP. So right now it's on Axel to see whether or not he can actually punish that. All right, calls in the little homie this time. Oh, good tech on the grab. Dive kick, yep. I believe that might be plus. I'm not 100% sure. All right, press Oh, snipes him out of the sky. DP, no, doesn't do anything after the DP. Right. Oh, no, drops his combo. No, but he, he, he got him this time. No, snipes him out of the sky again. All right, it's pretty tense right now. Both of these uh, players pretty evenly matched. Oh, just snipes him out from... All right, gets his orb. Yep, so the orb is gone. Nice combo. Oh, air DP. Oh, yeah, so if he blocked that, that would have been pretty minus. He could have got a fat combo for that. All right, no shields. Again, nice grab. All right, it's your turn. Oh, dodges the DP. Oh, but he gets him with the dive kick. All right, one up to Hagure. All right, getting immediately back in it. Let's see. Uh, let's see how Axel responds. All right, just jump C again. Oh, concentrate. Both of these two are trying to concentrate, going for that Vorpal. Vorpal, of course, very important in this game. It's everything. All right, little homie combo, yep. All right, good tech again. Oh, dive kick gets him again. So that dive kick's been doing a lot of work for Aguri so far in this set. All right, gets him in the corner, got it. Oh no, yeah, so he he didn't do anything in time and now he's gonna be dead for it. So Hagari on match point now. Oh, hits him going low. Maybe trying to press stand A there, 5A. Nope. All right, good patience from Axel right now. No, but stands up right as I say it. Commentator's curse. You hate to see that kind of thing happen. Command grab. Oh, no. That might be it. No. Doesn't use any of his meter. No, and gets him anyways. 
Two perfects in a row for Haguri. And Haguri's moving on to uh, winner's finals. All right, sorry for the wait, y'all. And then, yeah, how y'all doing out there? Let me know, let me know. You know, throw something in the chat if y'all out here. Uh, if not, all good too. <laughs> I know it's kind of a, a last minute thing uh, with me streaming this one. Um, but yeah, I think uh, from here on out, I'll probably be streaming uh, the uni tournament over here. I'll probably, I don't think I will be next week. Um, yeah, I might be a little tired from Anime Ascension. Uh, but yeah, from here on out, I know because uh, Tari and um, Tensei aren't able to make it out here um, due to Tensei starting school, grad school, you know, shout out to that. Um, but yeah, anyways, we up in here, right? So, oh, okay, so we've seen a phonon pick. Alright, cool, cool. So, oh, hold on, I got the names mixed up. But yeah, interesting. Um, have not yet seen, um, uh, I'm sorry, Dr. Dang's phone on, so let's see what we got. Oh, I'm sorry, uh, not Dr. Dang's phone on, but, uh, Landline's phone on. Oh, there, that's gonna take it. Oh, and then, yeah, somehow misses that. Yeah, not really sure how that interaction worked out, but here we go. Oh, no. <laughs> well, well, that player's trying to attack. Oh, and uses it as an anti-air. Did she have? Yeah, she didn't have Vorpal, I don't think so. Uh, it's a little bit slower. I know, once she gets the Vorpal, it's a lot easier to use as an anti-air. Um, it get, gains more head and bowl. Uh, starts up, starts up. I at least like six ring fasters or something like that. Um, but yeah, guess, uh... Um, yeah, pretty. Oh, gets a throw into the corner. Very nice awareness right there. He knew what he was trying to do. Okay, Orbiter. Oh, but doesn't use that to. Um, yeah, usually when you see Hides do ES Orbiter, it's either to keep them safe or to just like steal the turn. Uh, but yeah, Dr. Dang chose to lay it low, lay back a little bit. Ooh, oh, and that should be a punish. Oh, but no full combo right there. Oh, and it looks like, yeah, um, that was an invalid combo. I don't know if Dr. Dang knows how to tech. Um, yeah. yeah. I believe, yeah, landline will tell him. Alright, so right back in there. And yeah, starting, yeah, uh, landline's been using those fi fireballs to full effect. Um, not, you know. Not let. Oh, and that. Oh, okay. Oh, and gets a throw. Uh, again, into the corner, and yeah. Why am I using that chart? Uh, ooh, grid rate. And yeah, he was looking good for the Vorpal right there, but yeah. It's definitely gonna be Dr. Dang's turn right now. Oh, okay, and gets hit. Um, that's not. I don't think that hits low after. Oh, no. Throws to CS. And uh, Landline gonna be on game point right now. Could have actually used that CS to hit hide out of the air. Um, yeah, it doesn't really have a normal that goes at that angle. You know, as as long range as our normals. Oh, um, yeah, might have been able to. Yeah, ES. I don't know what the colloquial term for that is, but the splash. Oh, anti air is off of the second hit of the whip. Oh, oh no! I think he thought he had meter and uh. Yeah, went for the down down super, but did not hit. Oh, here we go. Oh, goes under the fireball. Good stuff. So this puts Dr. Dang into a good position. One more hit. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, no. And Landline steals it. All right. And yeah, I believe, yeah, that's it right there. 2-0. Um, yeah, definitely a, a little bit of unfamiliar to, there from Dr. Dang, but um, yeah, GG's dude, thanks for playing, you know, thanks for helping us uh, get a full eight-man bracket. Uh, but yeah, Landline will be advancing.
Um, his next matchup will be Axel. I'm not sure if that's who he's trying to, if he's gonna play that right now. Or no, it looks like we're gonna, oh yeah, probably see some interesting interactions over here. Um, trying to feel each other out, you know, and learn the matchup a little bit. But yeah, we in there right now, so let's go. So Axel Seth versus Landline Phonon. Oh, and Landline gets the first hit. Yeah, choose to use that, but yeah. Seth over there, yeah, building all that grip from the blocks in the shield. Oh, gets him with the cross up. It's a classic over there. Definitely gotta watch out for that. Uh, I got hit by it. Ooh, gets him with the charge. Oh. Alright, and then this should be a full combo. Oh no, whiffs it again. And yeah, that's uh, the same point where Axel was missing his combos earlier. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I believe he just has to dash up a little bit more. So that crescent arc uh, of the kick uh, hits on like not the small end, but you know towards the meteor part. Uh, but with that said, Axel go ahead and take the first round. Okay, so this is a meter. Uh, doesn't get too much of it. Oh, okay, CS and goes low. Oh no, it didn't get the jump forward there, so it's not gonna be. Oh, but the orb hits, and yeah, it was a counter. Oh no. Ooh, let go shield a little bit too early. Oh, again with the neutral jump miss. So yeah, here we go. Landline. Oh, this could do it. Yeah, there we go. Axel puts himself on the board. Up one. And yeah, uh, definitely looks like there's a little bit of unfamiliarity. Um, I know, yeah, over here in NorCal, uh, we don't have really any, too many, like, dedicated phonon players. So, you know, this matchup is definitely, yeah, especially here at ESA. Um, I know there's a few people out there who sub phonon down in Game Center. Um, but yeah, we don't have any dedicated phonons, um, you know, besides Landline who's been uh, picking her up uh, recently. Oh, gets a, gets a unlockable. Oh, man, that hitbox, though. Oh, but again, um, a missed input on the jump, and it's not able to follow up on the combo. Oh, but here we go. It's gonna hit, gonna get a punish off of that. Ooh. Ooh, that was a little tricky there. Um, but yeah, good stuff. Yeah, Axel's up on game point. Uh, Landline's gonna have to make some kind of adjustment uh, and, and stop letting Seth get in for three. Um, yeah, because when, once uh, Axel has been getting in, he's been getting the hit uh, pretty reliably. Oh, gets a throw. Oh no, beats the bail off. Uh, but yeah, doesn't get too punished too bad. Oh no! Oh, oh, almost, almost. Yeah, I really appreciate that effort. Back dashes out. Okay. Oh no! Um, yeah, ouch. This is gonna hurt. Um, I don't. Oh wait, he's got 200. Yeah, this will do it. Bam. Yeah, so just like that, Axel goes ahead with a pretty convincing 2 0. Oh, um, good stuff to that. And then uh, GG's to our TO landline. <laughs> hey man, you gotta have your color. No matter the game. Still her turn. Oh yeah. Uh, JDR yeah, back dashes out of that one. Again, back dash is the force function over there. Oh but here we go. Senior children's turn. Charges up. Oh, gets a gets a hit, but um yeah, still still her turn though. Oh, DPs for the win. 
Alright. Oh, yeah, um, yeah, pretty good. Uh, almost had it from Senior Children. Uh, just so, uh, yeah, that last confirm, if you would have got that, JDR would have been a big problem. So here we go. Alright, yeah. JDR backing off. Yeah. Looks like he's aware of Wagner's meter. Um, yeah, not really trying to, yeah, make it her turn, you know. Just going back to neutral and then taking it. But yeah, ooh, and this will do it. Yeah, perfect. So yeah, JDR goes up one on that last round. Real convincing over there. Um, yeah, just took took Senior Children to the corner and didn't let him out. Uh, so let's see, uh, yeah, if Senior Children can uh, bring it back to how it was in the first round. Uh, yeah, had a lot more bite in that one, and a lot more fight. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, these sword characters, man, they <laughs> love feeling each other out. And here we go. And yeah, that's one of the great things about Hive, right? You know, his BNB just takes you immediately to the corner. It doesn't really matter where it runs. There we go. Oh, okay, wake up throw. Very nice option over there. All right. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, I think uh, JR could have punished that with a perfect with a great shield, but yeah, just to keep it safe. Here we go. Oh, but gets a grid break, though. Force functions in. Charges up. Yo, looking real good right now for Sydney. Oh, oh, no. JDR. Okay. Oh, wow. Woo. Danger, danger. Yeah. JDR not trying to mess with that charge up sword. Oh, delayed uh, way. Yeah, to take it. Yeah, JDR really likes to use that to kind of like prevent you from or you know, protect you from putting buttons. There we go. Again, JDR up in the corner, pressuring. Oh yeah, that's why I'm in. I'm in Oakland, Russell. Good to see you. Yeah, yeah. I know. It's not not the normal games that I uh, usually streaming out over here. But yeah, and yeah, with this CBO, JDR is gonna take it. 2-0. Alright, so with that, I will be up next. Uh, definitely gotta get JDR playing uh, while we can. Uh, so yeah, this will be winner's finals, I believe. So uh, three out of five. Let me double check. Um, yep, this is winner's finals. So yeah, it'll be myself versus JDR.
wasn't planning on going originally, but last minute I saw they, they put the call out for volunteers and, you know, I was like, ah, you know, like, 
because I, you know, I, I ain't been doing too hot in uni lately, so I was like, ah, you know, I'll take this one, pass on this one, you know, maybe train up for the next tournament, but yeah, I saw they needed help, so <laughs> I had to go down there, um, but yeah, man, looking forward to it, gonna be lots of fun. Uh, hopefully see a lot see a lot of good uni out there man that's that's one thing that I really love about AA. Axis really puts a love for uni. But anyways, we here, we here, we got senior children versus the net square. Uh, yeah. Got the mix mix up, and this ain't no casual, this is tournament right here. Uh, losers round... Oh no, loud round two. Alright, got some damage over here. Oh, wake up EP, let's go. Yeah, Put respect on my turn again. Yeah, but. Oh, yeah, Wagner steals the corporal right here. Looking pretty good right now. Oh, wow, the Kiki catches him. Oh, counter hit, that's gonna do it. Just up to the next square. Second uh, um, Yeah, usually when you see that, um, I believe what you can do is uh, round start succeed and then immediately, you know, believing in it, going in for the roll, pick up off of that. Oh, just a little bit too far away for that leg to hit. Um, but yeah, and that square is still in there though. And yeah, uh, that's something I've been noticing uh, with the next square matches. So it's it gets pretty even, you know. He's definitely not blowing anybody's back out, but oh, here we go. Senior children. Oh, gets a hit. Oh, spins a meter. Okay, wants both charges. Ooh, breaking. Yeah, this is a oh, that'll do. Oh no. Oh. I believe he let go of the stick right there, the, let go of the controller. Oh, uh, yeah. So, yeah, senior children, go ahead. Go up around two. Oh, yeah, this time, yeah. Oh, okay, it's a... Ooh! Oh, but no punish right there. Okay. Let's see, what kind of combos we got seen here? Oh no, misses the super! Very unfortunate. Uh, still, you know, still gets a charge up there, but... Oh, imagine, that should do it! Yeah, senior children goes up one. Uh, but yeah, still... Yeah, still good effort from in that square right there. Uh, definitely, yeah, was no blowout again, like I said, uh, trying to say earlier. Um, yeah, and this square is just like, you know, hanging in there, you know, keeping it even. And a lot of times, uh, the ones that he's, the rounds that he's winning, it's just, he, he does some wild stuff, or, you know, the other character just like run into a 6C or something. Yeah, here we go, let's see. Oh, wow, first hit right off the bat. Oh, no, what's going on? Oh, yeah, good start to see your children. Already in the corner. Oh, jumps out. Yeah, if that was a meaty, that would have hurt. Okay, but here we go. Yeah. Get square back in there. Okay, going for the reset. Ooh! Oh, no! Uh, yeah. Oh, gosh! No! Oh, oh no! We not block it! And this, yeah, this is factor damage. Yeah, that's definitely good. Oh, two goes for the two hunt! Yo! Alright, yeah, no need for the meter. That's pretty confident over there. This is all the meter right there. And then again, starting off with that uh, CC. Oh, drops a combo. Ooh, uh, wrong, wrong move from the net square. Oh, okay. Here we go. Okay, get the super to hit this time. Oh, oh, okay. Just a pick up off of that throw. Oh, this is gonna do it. So yeah, just like that. Senior Chud and goes up to O over a net square. Um, GG to a net square though. It's good seeing some, some chaos action over here, you know. Um, but yeah, just uh, needs to work on the defense just a little bit. Um, and then yeah, get those confirms on, you know. Uh, but yeah, definitely has the right idea with chaos though, you know. It's using the 6C, you know, using Asri you know, to do some stuff. So, but yeah, good stuff, good stuff. 
Um, so yeah, next up we'll be having Senior Children versus Axel. So yeah, uh, now we are going to be having uh, Axel versus Senior Children. Um, I don't remember if they played last week or not, but um, yeah, uh, I'm assuming we're going to see Seth versus Wagner. Uh, yeah, so two bully old characters, you know. Both characters definitely love to take their turns and steal <laughs> steal the turns from the other. Um, but yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be real nice. Um, this will be loser semis, so winner of this will be fighting me over in loser finals. All right, going. I believe we might be going straight into there after this button check. Yep. Sure looks like it. Alright. Oh, uh, doesn't block the second hit of that shield. Alright, Wagner's in there with the throw in the corner. Blocks the assault. Okay, Axel messes out. Good stuff. Very good match right there. Oh, okay. DP's out. Yeah. He's saying, respect my DP. <laughs> Function. Gonna continue this and kill. Yup. All right, senior children gets the first round. Oh, run up the row. Yo. Um, the catharsis right over here. Oh, okay. Oh no, it doesn't get the full confirmed though. Um, yeah, it's pretty far uh, for Seth. But here we go. Force punches in. Yeah, and we got corner pressure. Oh, wait. Ooh. Yeah, I don't know if that was a setup, uh, that move over there. Oh, yeah, it goes for the Assault CS and we'll take that match real quick, like. Yeah, good stuff to Senior Children. Um, yeah, let's see. Yeah, Axel wasn't able to get his Zeph mix-up started. Um, yeah, he had a few hits, but I don't, I don't remember seeing a, um, a big combo from him. And um, normally, yeah. Oh, Ken with the run-up. Oh, yo, yo, we just doing this now, huh? Yeah, woo-wee. Alright. Oh, again, DP. Oh, with the meaty charges up. Let's go. Force function and kill. All right, and with that, senior children on, uh, yeah, match point right now. Yeah, um, these round starts from senior children are just obliterating Axel. He's just getting hit with every single one, I feel like. Oh, wow, DPs. Oh, a very good position for senior children right now. He's got the four pull. Oh, hits with the overhead into the fourth. Ah, oh, grid break. Oh, no, a very bad. Ah! Wow, yeah, senior children just bullying, man. Bullying Axe over there with the perfect at the end, yo. Dang, y'all, uh, all right. Then, yeah, that'll do it for that. Um, it'll be, yeah, Axel moving on to fight me in the loser's finals right now. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and set that up. Um, I don't believe I'll have commentary. Uh, RTO is away right now, so. Or actually, you know what? Maybe we could get JDR on the mic. I don't. I think he might be out of Dragon Ball right now. So. Uh, actually, you know what? It looks like he's doing the BB tag thing right now, uh, trying to TO that. So, yeah, probably gonna have a, a little bit of silence over here. But please enjoy our match. Uh, it will be the run back. Oh wait, sorry, no, no, not a run back. Uh, it'll be me versus Senior Children. Um, if he. Yeah, he's still there. Okay.
この虚無狩りの前に姿を現す。ファーストこの虚無狩りの前に姿を現すファーストクローズリバイドそれで終わりいきょんかわいいキリトッツそのとおりやらせちキリトッキリトッやらせちバイキンのシギルそのとおりセカンドクローズリバイド。この虚無狩りの前に姿を現すファーストクローズリバイドマイトメルカバ
I didn't let him play because I do not know that matchup. So, uh, yeah, we're going right back in there. Uh, going to finish it off with Grand Finals, uh, the run back against me versus JDR. Uh, let's see if I cannot get 3 0 again this time. Uh, yeah, it's been the classic uh, recently. So, uh, let's see. I believe JDR will be on the one piece side, of course, playing hide. And then, yeah, you know me, I'll be playing Merkaba. So. Again, uh, yeah, I don't think we got a commentator, so yeah, sorry about that for grand final. Well, actually, you know what? Let me let me look around and see if uh, yeah, uh, oh no, looks like everybody else is playing right now. So yeah, sorry about that, y'all. Um, so yeah, you know, just enjoy some good uni. <laughs> well, hopefully good UD. <laughs> and then yeah, see y'all on the other side. Um, yeah, after this uh, grand finals. Uh, BB Tag uh, will be going on. Uh, they're starting the round robin, I believe. So, yeah, we'll get that on next. All right, peace.